today is September 5th, 2018. I have about a week until my birthday. And I was supposed to start my vlogging last year. I recorded a few things, just never really posted them. And you know, I decided I'm just going to post it. Forget it. So the next few videos are going to be a recap of chapter 26, getting ready for chapter 27, and yeah, this should be interesting. Today is my birthday, chapter 26, and I must say, chapter 25 taught me to really do what makes me happy and the true meaning of doing what makes me happy. I'm about to start getting ready for my mini birthday turn up. Not doing much of nothing special this year. Just a little salsa with some friends. Good meal. And I'm excited for this new chapter. Today marks the first day of my me documenting my journey. Different approach to an old dream. I officially started school yesterday. Yay me. Jesus. But the fun is about to begin. And I'm ready. I'm excited to see what this year brings, and I'm accepting nothing but success and happiness. No drama. Of course, it's going to be everyday drama, but I'm going to move past it and move a lot faster and easier than I did before. And I'm really focusing on me and providing a better life for my children, and I'm excited. Life has a crazy way of teaching you shit. And I must say, lesson learned. Chapter 26 has only been in full effect for not even the full 24 hours. Oh, wait, I've been 26 in the full 24 hours. I just ain't been asleep yet. Shit. Well, I enjoyed my mini turn up with my sister, my jelly bean, and Rita. Salsa dancing was life. Um, as always, Stephen Green turned up for me. I really enjoyed my birthday dance. But I will say the moral of the story is... You defined your happiness. Tonight really showed me that sometimes I put too much of my happiness in other people. 
it's mostly because I'm a caring person and before I think about myself I think about others not saying that I have to change that in its entirety but I do have to alter it I do need to start putting myself first a lot more often and as women we generally just cater to our men I cater to my men I cater to my family I cater to my friends and at the end of the day not too many people actually cater to me actually I can't name not very many people actually cater to me and every year my birthday shows me that and I don't know why I keep ignoring it you gotta start actually embracing those that do I don't have many in my circle that even make me a priority. And that's going to change this year. So, chapter 26, full effect, lesson one, completely learned. And I'm ready to make the change.